Mark Milstead at Milstead's Boxing and Fitness, and today we're going to work on a right hook punch to the body. Now, a hook is used when you're in close to your opponent and you want to work his body over. You want to cause damage to his body with your, with your punches. Or in a box, we start off to learn it in a solid boxing position. Our hands are up, our elbows are in, our chin is down. We're going to go to the body with our punch. So, what we're going to do is drop our right hand. As we do, we, we bend our knees a little bit more than we normally would, say on a straight right. We bend our knees, we drop our hand, and as we do, we pivot on the ball of our back foot so that our toes point toward our opponent. As we do, we transfer about 65, 70% of our weight to our front leg. We, we keep the elbow in close to the body. We hit with our target, and then we snap our punch back. Now you want to keep the other hand up as you throw. You don't want to, you just want to try not to drop your hands, although it's a lot of people, even at the highest level, will do that. But to learn good form, you've got to coach yourself. We're kind of keeping your hands up. So the hands are up, you drop your hand, you bend your knees a little bit more than you normally would on a straight right, say. You pivot, and as you do, you keep your elbow in tight. Penetrate through the target, which is your opponent's ribs or solar plexus or, or uh, body area. You penetrate through the target and then you snap it back. Normally on a good hook to the body, your elbows don't go out much further than your body. You want to keep your, keep your punches in close to your body. And you're getting power in the punch by turning your hips and shoulders. That's how you're generating your power in your punch. Pivoting, digging with your hips and shoulders, violent turn of the hips and shoulders, and you're snapping the punch back. You penetrate and snap. Now, if you go up at a slight angle, if you want to get them in the, in the higher area, like the solar plexus or the upper ribs, or you can go straight out and back. You can also do this punch sideways, but the key is not to, not to hook your punch around. Even though it's called a hook, your arm is hooked here, but you want to go straight in and straight back out. <clears throat> Right shoulder dips a little bit, like it does on a right.